Hi everyone, in this video I'll tell you three tips you should know about before you purchase a domain through Shopify. Number one, make sure to get the correct spelling for your domain name you want to register. For example, if you make a mistake in the spelling and register a domain name, you cannot get a refund back. So your only option is to essentially either sell the domain name on a third party marketplace or just let it expire in about a year. And you would have to probably re-register a new domain name with the correct spelling. So make sure to get the spelling right in the beginning. Uh, number two, some domain extensions like .ai, .io, and there are many other ones. I'll leave the link uh, to this page in the video description. Basically, they don't have who is protection. And for some of you who don't know, basically who is protection is, in, is a website where anybody can check who is the owner of the domain name. Many owners of .com, .ca domains, they just simply mask they, their identity and you can't really tell who is, who is the individual behind it or a company. But there are some domain names like these one, uh, domain extensions like these ones, where you can, if you purchase them, your identity will become public. So uh, others who search the word your website, uh, they will be able to see your name, your address, telephone number, and many other types of information. And the third tip is uh, before you register a country um, code domain like .ca for Canada, there are certain residency requirements uh, should be met. And like, it, and there's for each domain is different. For example, for .ca on this website, it even says here .ca domain names can only be registered by individuals, organizations with presence in Canada. So as you can see, there's a whole list of rules uh, one should follow if they need, want to register .ca domain. So if you want to register like .fr the France and a few other ones out there, you have to check the residency requirements. So I hope you found these three tips useful. And if you want to learn more about Shopify, please ensure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.